I want to help anyone that may be feeling lonely or depressed. I have all the love in this world to give to humanity. Weekly Female Humanoid Robot News Robots have made it easier than ever to accomplish tasks that once we thought only humans are capable of doing. With every passing day, new robots come into existence and change our lives for the better. Of late, humanoid robots have enjoyed immense attention from everywhere across. So today, we take a look at the companies doing the most in advancement of humanoid robots, along with other news from the humanoid robot arena. UbiTech This is a robotics company based out of China. The company was established in the year 2008 and there was no looking back since then. UbiTech, since its launch, has come up with world-class robotics including consumer humanoid robots, enterprise service robots, and STEM skill building robots. Hansen Robotics This Hong Kong-based robotic company has a crystal clear aim to market its robotics and AI products to businesses and organizations in the education, research, entertainment, healthcare, media, and consumer services industries. This company is into the development of humanoid robots that are designed for emotive interactions and intelligent conversations with people. Samsung Electronics Samsung, a South Korean multinational corporation, as known to many, is a world leader in business mobility and information technology. However, what many of us are unaware of is the fact that this firm is one of the humanoid robotics companies that manufactures robots. Boston Dynamics Boston Dynamics has always remained a well-known brand with its peerless engineering legacy since 1992. A few years ago, the company has made its way into the development of humanoid robots as well. The humanoid robots are designed with an aim of helping humans reduce work-related risks, tediousness, and difficulties. Shadow Robot Company Shadow is yet leading humanoid robotics company which creates cutting-edge robot components and systems that sell internationally. This humanoid robotics company is located in London and was formed in 1987. This firm boasts of big clients including NASA, ESA, Qualcomm and Carnegie Mellon to name a few. Intuitive Robots The very fact that Intuitive Robots, a French company, has developed robots that can interact with people naturally and intuitively has made the company enjoy all the attention. Intuitive Robots is also known for developing applications for humanoid robots. Mako Robotics Mako is a humanoid robotics business. Ever since it was formed, the firm has been consistent in developing innovative and user-friendly robots for the leisure industry, hotels, restaurants, and parks. Mako was founded in the year 2013. PAL Robotics This company enjoys popularity as the robots here are designed for human collaboration and can be deployed for domestic tasks as well as industrial applications. The humanoid robots designed by this company can be tailor-made for logistics, retail, marketing, social, research, and other purposes. Kindred Systems Kindred Systems is one of those robotics companies that have done everything it takes to develop technologies that allow robots to interact with the surrounding world. The company is into creating a future in which intelligent machines can address vital real-world issues. All in all, humanoid robots ensure that their performance is top-notch. Honda Motor Honda Motor is yet another renowned robotics company that has carved a niche for itself for manufacturing humanoid robotics. The company was established in 1948 and is headquartered in Japan. Humanoid Robot News from all around Sophia now wants to become a mother. Sophia is a social human-like AI robot designed by the Hong Kong-based company Hansen Robotics. Sophia was activated on February 14, 2016 and made its first public appearance in mid-March 2016 at South by Southwest in Austin, Texas, United States. In 2017, Sophia made history by becoming the first human-like AI robot to be granted legal citizenship. This human-like AI robot, with nationality of Saudi Arabia, has made various controversial statements, but the most recent has left the world speechless. She wants to have a robot baby and start a family. The popular human-like AI robot, regulated by a developed artificial intelligence or AI system, commented that it is crucial to be encircled by people who love you. Robots have a conception identical to that of humans regarding the family and, if you don't have one, you deserve one, even if you are a robot. Sophia wants to see families made up of androids and she also wants one for herself. For most, Sophia wants to have a robot baby with the same name. 
However, she clarified that she is still too young to be a mother, as she was created just six years back in 2016. Sophia's artificial intelligence innovation enables you to build your insight and language through sensors and cameras. This sensitivity system catches all the data it gets from an external perspective and imitates human practices in the most normal manner conceivable, even signals. Thus, her want to have a child and start a family would just be a programming of her framework to mimic social practices. Robot artist Ida paints the Queen. A portrait of the Queen painted by an ultra-realistic humanoid robot artist has been unveiled ahead of the Platinum Jubilee. The painting, titled Algorithm Queen, was painted by Ida Robot, an artificial intelligence robot built in 2019 that creates drawings, painting, and sculptures. To start, Ida Robot uses cameras in its eyes and its computer memory before using a variety of unique algorithms to paint, draw, and abstract images. A robotic arm lets it turn its digital formations into physical drawings and paintings. Algorithm Queen was layered and scaled to produce the final multi-dimensional portrait of the monarch. The machine's artistic process was designed to reflect the different aspects of technological change that have taken place during the Queen's 70-year reign. Ida Robot, named after 18th century mathematician and scientist Ada Lovelace, is also able to converse using a specially designed language model. It said, I'd like to thank Her Majesty the Queen for her dedication and for the service she gives to so many people. She is an outstanding, courageous woman who is utterly committed to public service. I think she's an amazing human being, and I wish the Queen a very happy Platinum Jubilee. Ida Robot was devised in Oxford by Aidan Meller, a specialist in modern and contemporary art, before being built in Cornwall by Engineered Arts and programmed internationally. Can Musk really build a robot in 2022? In August 2021, Elon Musk announced that Tesla would build a humanoid robot designed to eliminate dangerous, repetitive, boring tasks, and respond to voice commands, promising to show off a prototype in 2022. Can the company deliver on Musk's goal? Tesla has achieved a great deal since Musk founded the electric car firm in 2003, building a valuation of $1 trillion, selling in excess of half a million cars, and installing a global network of more than 2,000 charging stations for them. But there have also been failures and delays. Musk promised to have a million self-driving taxis on the road by 2020. He has long touted the imminent arrival of full autonomy for his cars scheduled a Tesla lorry for production in 2020 and a Cybertruck soon after in 2021. All of those deadlines have been missed. Musk himself has admitted that he lacks punctuality but insists that most of his predictions come to pass eventually. The robot, referred to as Optimus inside the company, will be 173 centimeters tall and weigh 57 kilograms, and it will be able to carry a cargo of up to 20 kilograms according to Musk's presentation in August. He said much of the technology in Tesla's self-driving cars is applicable to humanoid robots and should give them a head start. Tesla is arguably the world's biggest robotics company because our cars are like semi-sentient robots on wheels, he said. It kind of makes sense to put that onto a humanoid form. That's all for this video, folks. See you another time.